In 2015, Didlake, a provider of contract services to help people with disabilities obtain employment, began working with DARS for a contract with the Naval Facilities Engineering Command. DARS referred more than 100 job candidates to Didlake, who, after a review and hiring process, were hired to provide custodial services to the Norfolk Naval Shipyard, Oceana Naval Air Station, and Dam Neck Training Center. DARS' contract with Didlake has employed more DARS consumers than any other contract in the agency's history. Ronald Estep, Director of Contract Operations, and Rose Silvis, Regional Manager of Human Resources for the Greater Hampton Roads area, talk about Didlake's partnership with DARS, the process of hiring candidates, and future plans. In November of 2014, we were awarded a contract with uh, Naval Facilities to take care of five bases in the Greater Hampton Roads area. Did Lake, we are a community rehab program. We offer support services, employment opportunities, and on-the-job training to individuals with disabilities. We offer opportunities for individuals with disabilities to be productive, to be able to take care of themselves. We offer them stability, full health insurance. DARS opened their offices to us where we actually came to the DARS offices and interviewed uh, their consumers. We anticipated that we would start the project at 50%, meaning 50% of our direct labor staff would have a disability. Because of the efforts of DARS and the teamwork between Didlake and DARS, we were able to start the project at 92%. This year alone, we'll probably hire 200 people from DARS. You know, in the very beginning, it was, a, it was a tough start. But it's slowly starting to come around and we're starting to get positive feedbacks. And to watch that happen from an entire base, it's been, it's been pretty remarkable. Many of our employees get support from families and just the fact that the families heard feedback from their, their son or daughter or significant other, um, that even kind of eased their fears as well. We work with people to, to provide them with support um, through our job coaches and, our, uh, uh, and the DARS counselors to help them be successful. And I want nothing more than everybody that worked with me to be fully successful. I think I speak for both Roe and myself. We, probably would not have been able to reach our goal of the amount of people that we needed to hire if it weren't for dollars.